Hello guys and welcome back to John Vapes. So today we are finally getting round to doing um, this month's vape mail subscription review. So yeah, so we've got, um, it's not the silver package, don't worry, I've not downgraded again. Uh, we have actually got the gold package, it's five balls, but they send them in silver packages. I think they must have run out of gold packages this month. So yeah, vape mail subscription. Right, I think I'm just going to jump right into this one. I'll, will say one thing um there is a just in here that i watched um uh, i watched a fix review um yesterday um and he said there was a couple of flavors in here that were not the nicest so what i'm going to do is i think it's this cherry fudge ripple one um this one right here from i can't remember where this is from probably getting a glare from the window there um dark delights that's what it is um, so it is this one here. Um, oh, why is this camera so bad at focusing? Anyway, it's a cherry fudge ripple. Apparently, it doesn't taste the nicest. So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to do this in order. I'm going to do the first um, two in order, and then I'm just going to make so that this one's last. Um, and I'm just going to move a couple of things about. It's the reason is I'm moving at the moment. So, like I said in the last video, I've packed all my um, my vape stuff away. So all my wicks are away, uh, all my cotton and stuff like that. And I've just not had the time to find it all. I will need to get it out because um, I managed to get a little bit and I managed to re-wick re -wick this last night. So it's not too bad. Um, so yeah. First off, we're starting with a juice from Big Juice. It's called Pixie Dust. Um, vaping is a must with a little of our pixie dust. Fizzy, fantastic, berry, ta uh, berry lemon tang. Berry lemon tang. So pixie dust, which is this one here. You probably can't see the writing because my camera is really bad at um, focusing. Do we give us a smell? Hmm. That's a bit. It's a bit strange. It's almost like a, um, it's almost like a, I don't know how to say it. It's almost like a kind of like a fizzy or like a, a sherbet. Oh. Can I smell? Yeah, it's almost like a kind of fizzy kind of smell. So, Tsunami back on the IPv5 because I finally got my batteries charged. Um, I'll whip this bad boy up. Still same uh, 0.5-ish <laughs> micro coils. Um, it had been wicked recently. Oh, got wicked last night. Was it last night? It was yesterday. It was yesterday after my yesterday's video. Um, no, I actually done it before yesterday's video. This dripper is an absolute mess. I need to. I need to clean everything out. I'm going to actually buy myself a supersonic. Uh, a supersonic. I'm going to buy myself an ultrasonic cleaner sometime in the near future um, because this really needs uh, cleaning out um, because it's black and it's like a weird material like really like I've got like a kind of just like an old tea towel that um, I used to use um, I use it sometimes for my cooking and stuff like that but I actually bought for myself some new chef ones um, and I had this line about so what I did is I just cleaned it and I'm just using that as my kind of vape rag as a kind of thing. So anyway, I'm rambling here. This is Pixie Dust from Big Juice and it smelled a bit fizzy on the smell so we'll just see. Are we still at 50 watts? Yes we are. Yeah, well that's a weird one. Oh, that's a weird one. It's almost like kind of definitely like a fresh lemon. It tastes kind of like a lemon sherbet, or like uh, actually, it tastes like a like a. Oh, I can't forget it. It's almost like a kind of like a lemon sorbet ice cream. I see that in restaurants sometimes you'll have. Um, you'll have like your starter and then you'll have um uh, obviously you have your starter main and dessert sometimes what they do is in kind of 
some restaurants they give you like between your starter and your main they give you a sorbet and what it does is it cleanses your palate cleans out your palate so that then so say if you've had i don't know should i think say if you've had like battered um deep fried um garlic mushrooms or you've had garlic or something or you've had like some sort of like dipping sauce so like in a indian restaurant you may have um, pakora to start and you put it in pakora sauce some things that kind of lingers about and then when you taste your curry it kind of doesn't taste as nice so what they sometimes do is they tum- sometimes give you a lemon sorbet between your starter and your main and it cleanses your palate this is what this kind of tastes like but it's kind of a little bit more fizzy it's a bit more like a, a sherbet kind of thing it's a weird one this but it's nice yeah I like that one so that was pixie dust from Big Juice and that's quite nice juice actually and I've just touched the mic so I'm really sorry if you heard that um, next we have got Verdandi it's a weird name Verdandi from Drip Hacks and this is a key lime cookie pie back in stock due to popular demand revised and improved alright I've not been in with Vietnam very long but I've never had this before so key lime so this is going to be lime it's key lime cookie pie. I'm just getting quite a lot of lime there. I'm not really getting any like biscuity or cookie smells coming from that. But we'll give it a vape and see how we go. Vape the rest of this off. That should do this. So Verdandi. I always drip way too much on the first coil. What is the right way around? I put this on the wrong way around earlier on and I like nearly took a draw with like only one side they have open and I was like, why is that sound like it like obviously the note changes and I was like, that sounds really weird. But anyway. So getting quite a lot of lime there. Yeah. <coughs> Pardon me. I'm not really getting any cookie. There's a little bit of cookie on the back note, but it's just mostly just lime on the way in. Um so if you like your key lime cookie, if you like your sorry, if you like your key lime vapes, that's a really nice or your lime vapes. Um, if you're quite a nice fruity kind of refreshing fan, I think that's quite a refreshing vape. But yeah, it's kind of just lime at the front, and then on the exhale you get a nice kind of like cookie base. I'm not really tasting any pie though. Not not any pie, but yeah, it's almost like a lime cookie. It's quite a weird mix, but like I said, the the cookie isn't like right there, so it doesn't really taste as weird as you think. Um, and obviously it's a key lime, so it's not like a refreshing, it's not like a, it's not like a tanny, tanny, like a tanny not tanny, it's not like a tangy lime, lime, so, so it's not like biting into like a fresh lime and you'd be like really sour. Nice, a little bit of sweetness to it, not too much. So yeah, that was Verdandi from Drip Pack. So next one is supposed to be Cherry Fudge Ripple, but I'm actually going to put that aside. And we're going to go to, um, not that one. We're going to go to um, Black Mini Mi- Blackberry Mojito from Flavor West. Sweet blackberry and zesty mint chilled over ice. I didn't actually realise a mojito was a mint drink. Normally it's like strawberry and raspberry and stuff in mojitos, so this is going to be a bit of a weird one. I do like my. Uh, my cocktails but I'm not a massive mojito fan so I don't know how I'm gonna like this one. Oh this bloody earful. There we go. So this is a uh, blackberry mojito uh, from Flavor West. Oh wow that's a weird one. That is a really weird one. 
I just want to smell this one actually. So in the smell, you're just getting like a wee kind of tiny, tiny hint of blackberry with just, it's like a really nice fresh mint. Pretty much the same in the taste, blackberry and then at the, in the kind of in the inhale, but mostly on the exhale I'm getting just like a nice really fresh mint, so it's almost like a chewing a mint leaf. Uh, Mm. I quite like that one actually. Again, nice refreshing, um, nice refreshing vape that one. So the first three have actually been quite nice refreshing vape. I would use them mostly, they'd be quite nice summer vapes um, to maybe take on holiday or if it's hot outside. So yeah, that was Blackberry Mojito from Flavor West. <laughs> Moving on to the next one, which should be the last one on the list, and this is the one I'm most looking forward to. It is from the people at Exceptional Vapes. I've heard a lot about them and I've heard they make really really nice juices. Uh, it is a jam, roly-poly and custard. Homemade jam, roly-poly, squishy sponge rolled in sticky jam covered in thick creamy custard. That just, that just sounds like heaven. Vaping, that, is, that just sounds like vaping heaven. This balls a bit tough to squeeze. There we go. Oh wow. Oh, oh! I can smell that all day. That smells like oh, just bring me back to my childhood. That smells like um, smells like a nice kind of jammy sponge, and you're just getting. I'm just getting. I'm not really smelling like a custard kind of smell. I'm just smelling like a nice cream. It's a nice creamy smell. <laughs> Oh wow, oh, oh that is absolutely amazing, wow. Oh. So yeah, a jam roly poly, um, other people might know it as a Swiss roll, but over here in, in the UK, jam roly poly, all it is it's just a, um, a normal kind of normally be like a vanilla sponge so just like a victoria sponge kind of mixture and it's rolled with jam in the middle and then um sometimes it's coated um kind of the times i've made it um like in college and in restaurants and stuff like that sometimes you coat it with sugar and then it's got uh, you'd normally have a slice of that um, and you can see like so when you cut it you'd see like the spirals of jam around the middle um, and that would and then you'd pour custard on the top of that and that's exactly what it tastes like But that is an absolutely amazing juice. That that bottle is not going to be there very long. So the next one is the one that I heard um, Vic from Vaping with Vic talking about. Um, Cherry Fudge Ripple. Which actually in the name sounds really nice. Um, but... Oh... I actually smelled this one before because I actually wanted to see if it was smelt as bad as he said it was. But yeah, it's pretty disgusting. Oh wow. I don't really know if I want to vape this or not. Oh, this is going to be so bad. I don't know what's going on with this bottle either. So you can, I don't know if you can pick this up. But it's got kind of like... It's almost like there's kind of like a, a, a layer of something on top of the bottle. I don't know what's happened. Oh god. Mm. Okay. So yeah. Dark Delights brings you Cherry Fudge Ripple. It's quite a self explanatory description. But yeah, I don't know if these guys are picking this up. I don't know if this camera's going to pick it up. It's almost like it's got like a kind of layer of like. It's almost like a fudgy colour on top, and it's kind of like spots of it are stuck to the bottom, the side of the bottle. I don't know if I give it a good shake. No, it doesn't really go away. Anyway, yeah, it doesn't. Smell too good. To me, it smells like really synthetic, like fake, like a kind of perfumey cherry smell. Doesn't smell very nice. Uh, oh, oh no, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. Wow, that's really bad. Oh no. 
no, I don't like that at all. Oh, I'm really disappointed with that. Yeah, it tastes really fake. Like, just really fake. I heard Vic talking about it and he says it tastes like, almost like a kind of cherry, um, like a cherry medicine, like cough medicine. And yeah, I'm gonna have to agree with him on that one. That does, that's what it tastes like. Um, yeah. I don't think that one will be getting vaped. That can go to the back of the shelf. Um, actually, well, not right now, but. So yeah, guys, that has been this month's vape mail. Um, quite, some quite unusual flavours, I think. Um, I, I, there's quite a lot of flavours in there that I've never tried before. Like, I've never tried a lemon vape, never tried a key lime vape, and I've never tried a blackberry vape. So, I've tried jam. I'm not actually. I've not tried a jam vape either. I've tried loads of custards. I'm a massive custard fan. Um, so yeah, that was. If I can get all these, that was this month's vape mail. So yeah, again, uh, big thanks to um, vape mail for their amazing service. They're really really nice service. Um, their juices. I think they're. In my opinion, the juice packs are really like nice and cheap and cheerful. Um, I mean that nine ninety nine for a silver package, which is two bottles a month. Um, they're all ten mil, all thirty mil, uh, all thirty milligram. Wow, no, all thirty. What trying I say? All three milligrams. Sorry, they're all eighty twenty, and they come in these little kind of ten mil bottles. So you get five of these with the, you get two of these with the gold one, so it would come like that. And then with the with the silver one, and then the gold one, you get five. Um, and I can't remember the other ones. Um, if you just go and look, um, the address is actually there. Just vapemail.co.uk. You have a look, and as soon as you go on the page, if you just scroll down a little bit, you'll see all the kind of packages. And um, they do like massive ones. Like I think they go up to about fifty pound a month. Um, and that's the platinum, platinum XL, I think it is, or diamond XL. Um, and that's something stupid, like ten bottles or something. Um, so yeah, that one's vape mail. It was nice and interesting, new flavours for me to try, never tried them before. Um, and yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. If you did not enjoy the video, please leave a, a dislike. If you'd like to hit the red subscribe button down below, that would be absolutely amazing. And yeah guys, I will see you guys next time.